Hello folks, this is G-Wave here, and we're back with another God of War Ragnarok. Last time we were here, we met Freya's brother, and Freya and her brother have a little issue. Also, Freya can talk in her hawk form. She sounds cute when she's like this. Like, it's real adorable. So I'm still dealing with the internet connection issues. So, like I said, you know, I'll try to get these videos out soon until Wednesday. Supposedly, they're going to come and fix it. Hopefully, they do. Mm. Atreus would agree with you about prophecy. He rushes blindly to the fate the giants foretold. He disappears for two days, trying to prove he is their champion, fabled to fight at Ragnarok. I know all the Ragnarok prophecies. There's no Atreus will not be a pawn of prophecy. You still stand against fate, even with victory foretold. I will not march my son to war. He is no Spartan. I would keep it that way. You would speak to me of protecting your child? Is my tragedy not enough of a lesson? Fighting fate is a waste of the precious time we're given to spend with them. You never know when someone will come along and cut it short. Okay, quit making it personal. You need to understand why Kratos did this to Balder. Let me say this flat out to you, Freya. Your son was a lost cause. He was a lost freaking cause, and you know that. You knew the moment that Balder killed you, he wasn't going to be satisfied. He was just going to go on a mad, murderous rampage and kill everyone and everything in sight. And that would have made Odin super damn happy. So quit making it like it's my freaking fault. Stop it. Stop it right now. What about the crane? Can you turn it somehow? Can you swing that torch to the other side and burn the bramble blocking your path? You can probably use those islands to get a better angle on the torch, no? There we go. Let's cross the bridge. Now.
anyone alive be squeamish about war? After all the thoughts you've killed. I have seen the war to no cost. And I don't? After the price I paid to end one? Look around you, Kratos. See what happens when you don't fight the truth. Okay, can you stop making it all about you? Like, I get it, Freya. You're sad. You're miserable. I understand. But stop making it all about you. All right. Now back to the task at hand. Uh, would you be patient? God, you're a terrible travel companion. Remind me to never go on a trip with you, God. That's one of Odin's captains. Be ready. <laughs> my limit for enlightened platitudes from you today. Can you please just shut up and kill things? Well, maybe if you just accept that it's not my fault only that Baldur turned out the way he did, this would be easier for us. Like, stop admitting it's my fault only. It's not my fault only, Freya. You admitted that you did everything to Baldur because you were selfish. You did it for yourself. You didn't even bother talking it out with him. And when he begged you to take it away from him, you tried to justify what you did. So stop having a victim mentality. Yes, you might have been the victim at one point, but not anymore.
tell me to kill again. What? I killed to protect my son, to aid my friends. But I will be no one's monster. Never again. You don't get to make that choice. Not with the debt you owe me. I am not here for debts. I would always have helped you. So much has been taken from me, and I'm just supposed to let it all go? Freya. Enough. Freya, I think you should stop, because Kratos is reaching his breaking point with you, girl. He's out here helping you out of his own generosity. And you're going to be an asshole and keep on acting like you didn't have any fault at what happened with Balder. Fine. But don't be a bitch. I feel the source of the magic keeping me in Midgard. What is this place? My home. I was born here. Hold on. Something's not right. Of course it's not. Bera. World tree roots bound in Odin's damn knots. That's how he did it. Come on! Holy crap! What is this? Do not tell me what to do. Now this thing looks cool. What the heck? Did it just took things in his private? Eww. Yeah. 
On it. Hmm. Yeah, take this. That's stupid. Stupid. Oh, he's taking it to his giny again. Here we go. That's his stomach? Oh, I thought it was something else. Here we go. Let's finish this. was just as epic as the dragon fight. So these are branches of the world tree from every single realm. What happened to your armor? You know I can you can ask for help, right? Look, that's what happened to Balder when his curse was released. His tattoos flew blue. Is it done? Look, Kratos got his axe out, ready to fight. I suppose this is the point where I forgive you, where I kill you. Have you decided? Freya, come on.
to be honest. I don't think I can do either. There's still a part of me that is so angry that it'll always be. It'll always be angry. With me? But no. You are not the one who needs to die. I do see that. Everything that's happened between us. No need to explain. Freya. Not to me. I'm not the one you need to explain this to war. Yes! I do not regret saving your life. I really don't. The choice between life and death should have been yours to make. I should not have robbed you of that choice. Boy, this thing was epic. This thing was a really epic boss battle. Like, I'm probably going to make a short asking what you guys think is more epic. This guy, the Needhog, or the Dragon? Now that I am myself again. I suppose it's time to face my brother. And after that? I don't know. It's been a long time since I've had a choice. Look at this thing. Look at this. All day. Guts. This thing was an epic boss battle. So Freya is now our friend again. We can take this way back to the camp. I can help with the vines. Now embed your blades into the glowing vines and light it. Your brother seemed open to your return. Oh, I'm sure he'd love nothing more than for everything to go back to how it was. Leaving the responsibilities of leadership to me. So that's why you're mad at him. You're mad at him because he gave you so much responsibility. Okay, is there a god of family counseling? Oh yeah, Freya's fighting with us. Oh 
Learn to use what you have. After you? Seriously, Freya, you're a good it's not party as member. I want to be angry with Freya. He's my brother. He was the most important person in the world to me for half my life. Plants are the same as those we saw earlier. Boss should make quick work of their poison. Oh, God. As though I want to be angry with Freyr. He's my brother. He was the most important person in the world to me for half my life. These plants are the same as those we saw earlier. Frost should make quick work of their poison. Now the sigil should hold the frost, even in the axe's absence. Well done. Okay, Freya. It's okay. Whoa! Wait. Skull and Hottie are in Vanaheim? We learned the giants rescued them from Odin and brought them here. And look. The sunlight wakes the sleeping woods. See how they stretch to welcome the sun? Beautiful, no? A far cry from the sheets of Midgard snow I've grown accustomed to. The Eastern Migration. It's just as I remember it. At least the whole realm hasn't fallen to predators and occupiers. I guess there's still something to be fought for here. Something to defend even after so much damage has been done. Maybe that goes for Freya. So we just saw Skull and Hati, those two wolves that eat the sun and the moon.
During Ragnarok, Skull and Hunty are destined to eat the sun and the moon. Make a really good team, Freya. has happened since I last saw Freyr. I'm not even sure where to begin. What do you want from him? An apology would be a start. I want to forgive him. I'd like to think he's changed. He's all I have left now. Did you ever apologize to Demos? It is difficult to seek forgiveness when you feel unworthy. Unworthy. Well, guys, unfortunately, then we're going to have to end. Seriously, that boss battle was epic. Like, the mini-boss with one of Odin's captains, that was really good. But the uh, other thing, the... Uh, let me see. Uh, let me hear what's this. somewhere around here The Nighthog. The Nighthog? That 
that was a good boss. That was really epic right there. So I'm going to end this here. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Like, subscribe to the channel. Check out my TikTok and Instagram. Like I said, be patient because my internet connection's messed up and I got to get ready for Thanksgiving. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Like, subscribe to the channel. And all that fun stuff. Have a happy Thanksgiving. I'll see you guys next time. This is G-Wave signing out. Peace. God bless. Have a good day or night. Bye.